Well, welcome back to another edition of At the Desk with Dave. Today we're going to do something fun with spray paint art. Uh, we saw this at the Pensacola Fair and our family does it for fun and uh, we don't have much skill at it but I'll show you how easy it is. And it's great for kids because it can build their confidence. So uh, Kelly's filming me today, my wife, and she's going to run over here and you can watch this and watch the time of this video of how quick and easy this is and you can't mess it up. So here we go. We're just going to have some fun and do a little uh, uh, space scene. So let's have some fun. We're going to spray some yellow in here. Just because we want some yellow in there. And then some orange. Okay, how about that? And then uh, maybe some red. All right. And what you do is you take a little piece of newspaper here. And when you lay this over this, you can run your hand. You get a little splotchy look like that. And then we can take something like this and... Uh, I don't know if this frisbee is going to be big enough. I didn't make it that big. Uh, we'll do a planet right here in the center. All right. Then we can take, uh, do some purples. We'll put a little planet up here or something. And I don't know. What do you get when you put purple and orange together? I don't know. Throw some colors in there. Uh, how about some white? Any white in that? Okay, cool. Alright, we'll take this newspaper again, and we'll spot that, get some kind of weird color, we'll put that cap over there and make a planet. Alright, then all we got to do is take some black, and uh, we'll create a, a background of space all black. A new can of paint. There we go. And you just spray black everywhere. You just have fun, you can't mess this thing up. So now we got deep space now. And sometimes what we like to do is create a little pyramid down here. Uh, so let's get a, a, some orange and make a wild pyramid. So we'll put some oranges in here. And uh, maybe some yellows in this. And uh, I don't know, how about some blues? see what kind of color we can turn out there. What you do with that is you get you a piece of paper that's got a good edge on it. Now we get a piece of newspaper. And you just lay that in here. I need a little bit wider color here. in here see how that turns out make that stay a little bit then we can add some water or something around like that let's do something simple like that and make this kind of water or blue or something all right and if you want to even up your edge you can take a piece of newspaper this and hold it and kind of respray your black and cut a better line if you if that's important to you. All right. So then you just get creative. So, well, what can I do with that? Maybe I don't want to do anything with it, uh, or maybe I want to put some white streaks in it for uh, some water. So I might just streak this, and take my fingers, and create some kind of cool water design or something through here. Whatever it creates, just have fun with it. Doesn't really matter. And then uh, we can lift this up and see what we got on our pyramid. 
which looks pretty cool. So uh, we kind of missed a spot over here so we can see you can't mess up. Spray a little color in there. Maybe a little yellow is in there. And if you need to fix that up, just blot that. Okay. And then if you want a shadow, it's kind of nice to put on your pyramid. Just cut an angle like this. At the desk with Dave spray paint art. Okay. All right, now if we want to do some stars up here, what we like to do is just make the paint can spit. And if you want a, a burst in there like that, or something like that over there, over there, some streaks. You want to streak through here just do that and let's take this off and this off cool. and there you go you have just a few minutes at the desk with Dave spray paint art well I hope you enjoyed that that's a quickie a lot of fun for the family I hope you enjoyed it see you next time on at the desk with Dave